7 News. This is 24-7 News at 10 on your side. First at 10, new measures going into place as the coronavirus pandemic continues to spread in the DMV and across the country. Tonight, Metro announcing major changes and more. Businesses in our area forced to shut down, but tonight at the White House, President Trump emphasizing his goal to ease social distancing guidelines around Easter. That's about two and a half weeks away from now. Ultimately, the goal is to ease the guidelines and open things up to very large sections of our country as we near the end of our historic battle with the invisible enemy. <laughs> We're going for a while, but we win. We win. Now, despite that optimism from the president, the nation continues to take precautions to stop the spread, including right here in D.C. This information just in from Mayor Bowser. We now know all non-essential businesses must close by tomorrow at 10 p.m. That order will be in place through April 24th, and it covers salons, barbershops, and tattoo parlors. Seven on your side, speaking to one business owner who's now on edge. We're contacting the landlord, we're applying for small business loans, um, you know, what the city has made available for that, but it's still, it's the underlying current of fear. Nobody knows. It's, it's our business, it's our livelihood, and that multiplied by millions of stylists around the country and the world. And as you know, businesses are coming to a halt as coronavirus cases in the DMV rise. Here's a look at the current numbers. Tonight, there's now more than 800 confirmed cases in our area. In Virginia, we've learned two more people have died of COVID-19, bringing that total number of deaths to nine in the Commonwealth. Meanwhile, Maryland reported the state's fourth coronavirus-related death just today. Tonight, the virus has taken Metro by storm. Drastic measures now saying that 19 of its stations will be closed Thursday. Seven on your side's Heather Graff is tracking these new developments from the archive station. One of the stops that will soon shut down. Heather. And I got to tell you, the archive station is almost eerily quiet right now. Take a look behind me. It's been this way. Not a soul in sight for hours. This station closing because it's just a few blocks from the Gallery Place Chinatown station. Others, according to Metro, like the Clarendon station in Arlington, are closing because of extremely low ridership. Video like this, taken during what's supposed to be the evening rush hour, illustrates just how few people are currently using Metro. A 90% decrease in ridership as the coronavirus pandemic has the transit agency and city leaders urging everyone to stay home. And we 